not going to be another run video, but I'm out for a run this morning. It's a beautiful day. Good afternoon, guys. Um, it's Christmas Eve. Well, it's Christmas Eve in Australia. It's not probably Christmas Eve yet in other parts of the world, but it's Christmas Eve in Australia. Um, so I'm about to go away for Christmas, just up to the coast in Australia, just a couple of hours away from Sydney. Um, I'm going to try and do some vlogs when I'm there. Um, I know this is probably a poor excuse, but if I don't, I'll, I'll do it on my return. Um, sometimes it's a bit hard, like I wasn't going to do a vlog today because I've been watching other YouTubers actually saying about the daily vlogging thing. Now, I don't, as you know, I don't do daily vlogging, um, but you know, I try to do it as regular as possible, so I try to do at least four vlogs a week. Um, this week I've been a little bit slack. I think I did one a couple of days ago, but um, I tried to, I started, actually I started one the day, uh, yesterday, but I didn't get very far, so I didn't bother trying to put it together. Um, yeah, so Christmas holidays, Christmas break, um, a little bit weird because Natasha's not here, she's still in London. But I guess just have to make the best of it. Um, I'm going to see my brothers up on the... Like I said, I'm going to see my brothers for Christmas. And um, their family, and it should be good. You know, it's just, I just played back the little bit I just recorded then. I mean, sometimes it's very hard to do these. It's, it's, you know, it's not... Vlogging's not easy. I mean, everyone says, you know... I know there's a lot of people doing it, but it's really not easy. Um, you know, I don't do four vlogs a week. I, I, I int my intention is to do four vlogs, four daily vlogs per week. Um, you know, that's, that's my aim. I, I mean, I probably should have said that's my aim in the, um, in the new year is to do, is to do probably four a week. Um, if I can get four up every week, I think that's, 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 you know, if I can get four up a week, then that's satisfying. Yeah, I probably do about two, two vlogs a week. Two, yeah, two or three vlogs. I want to really grow the channel next year, though. I really want to like really do more interesting content and 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 connect with you guys and um, you know start start filming. I don't know. Start doing. I'm trying to work out a few ways to do it, and and when I come up with it, I'll let you guys know. But um, I mean, I like doing the camera review things. I mean, I have I have some good friends in. Uh, have a good friend in Sydney who has some really nice cars and whose family has really nice cars. So, I mean, I thought about doing that, but you know, I'm not really a car vlogger because there's so many car vloggers. Um, I don't know. I just, I just like the idea of just talking and connecting and you know, I like reviewing things. So I think I'll keep up with the, re with the reviews and, and a few more of these little, you know, just chats in between of what I'm doing in between the reviews, but I will keep that up. Um, Obviously, I can't review as many things as other vloggers because, you know, I don't buy everything. Uh, I, buy, I buy quite a lot of things, you know, for my channel and, and for work and things like that. But, you know, I don't, <clears throat> I don't buy a lot of things. I mean, I really, really would like to get the Mavic drone. I really would like to buy the DJI Mavic drone. Um, I was looking at it today and, and in Australia it takes, at the moment it takes... I think six weeks for delivery for the full package. I mean, I'm tempted to get it, but then I'm worried that I'm not going to be here in six weeks time. So not quite sure what to do. And also I think it's a bit difficult to fly it in the UK. I think it's easier to fly it in Australia. You know, when I say, you know, I say I like reviewing things. I'm not, I'm not a experienced reviewer. I just, you know, I just like to talk about what I've bought and, you know, I know I've got some dislikes from people on some of my reviews and I know they're not comprehensive and, and I never claim for them to be comprehensive. I just think if there's a couple of things you can take out of, out of the videos and you can use it and it helps you either to set up your GoPro, you know, to use ProTune, you know, to get an idea of what the Osmo Mobile is like. You know, the Osmo Mobile video has got a lot of dislikes, you know, for, for the amount of views that I get. And I guess... Yeah, it's not a comprehensive review, but it kind of annoyed me that all the, the forums are saying that the Osmo Mobile doesn't work with an iPhone. It actually does work with an iPhone. It works with an iPhone. The 4K rendering is struggles with the iPhone. Struggles with the DJI Osmo, the, the, sorry, the DJI Go app is, I think, the problem. It's not the Osmo Mobile on the iPhone. You know what I mean? I've used it in 4K. It works fine. It works in 1080. On the DJI Go app, it works in 1080. So sometimes I just like to get that point across. I mean, I'm not, 
an experienced reviewer and I know there's a lot of people on YouTube who do a much, much better job than me. But, you know, in time I'll get better and I'll post more videos and, and that's what I'm trying to achieve. I just need the support to get there. And, you know, I have got the support and I thank you for that. Um, I'm almost at my first goal of 100 subscribers. Uh, that was my first goal, 100. My second goal is 1,000. Obviously, it's going to take me a little bit longer to get there, but, you know, thanks for the support so far. It's been great. You know, and I appreciate all the comments, good or bad, and the dislikes. I mean, I have to have dislikes to know the reason why people, you know, there's some things that people don't like about my videos. Um, yeah. Oh, one other thing. I bought the Rode VideoMic Pro. I know you're thinking, well, don't you have one already? Every vlogger has a Rode VideoMic Pro. Well, it's for my Sony a7S, which I use occasionally when I'm at home, when I want to set it up properly. And I used it in London quite a, little, uh, quite a lot on some of my vlogs. Um, but I bought one yesterday. I mean, you've seen it before, right? You want to see it? I'll show you. So, Rode VideoMic Pro. Obviously the newer version. As you can see, I still haven't taken out of the box. And the Dead Cat VMPR, which goes with the microphone. You have to be very careful to get the right Dead Cat because they're still selling the old Dead Cats for the old Video Mic Pro. I haven't opened it yet. I don't think you really want me to do an unboxing of that. It's not very exciting, but yeah, I got that the other day. So, um, um, I'll test it out probably in, in after Christmas. Anyway, as you can see, I'm, I'm kind of set up here to work today, but I'm not really doing any work. Um, having my coffee, of course, at uh, 4.30, 5.30 in the afternoon. Um, need to get some more hard drives. I don't know if, I'm guessing a lot of people use these, but these lacy rugged hard drives, the two terabyte ones are great. I mean, they're Thunderbolt. My computer is still Thunderbolt. I haven't upgraded my Mac. I still use the Western digital ones as well. These ones, which are quite, quite inexpensive, but I basically use those for like storage and, and things like that. I don't really, I don't use them for the video is use the lacy rugged for the video. Um, not a lot to talk about today. I just thought I'd post a, a, I just thought I'd post a short vlog and just tell you guys that I'm still around and I will be posting over Christmas. Um, I'm going to do a car. I'm actually going to put the GoPro in the car when I drive up to the coast tomorrow. Um, the road up there is actually quite nice and <clears throat> you go over the, you know, through the country and through the rivers and it's, it's quite a nice drive. So hopefully I can capture some of that and, um, share it in a vlog in the next few days. You know, I watched that, um, I watched the thing and I can't remember the guy's name and I probably should know his name if I'm talking about it, but the YouTube guy, the YouTuber that got thrown off the flight by speaking Arabic. Um, I watched that. I'm not going to comment on it, but I just want to say one thing. A YouTuber, you're in the public eye. You become a public figure. Uh, especially when you have a lot of subscribers and people recognize you and people go to your channel. You are influential. You are someone that should be behaving in a certain way in public. Um, you are a public figure. I think we all need to respect that. Happy holidays.